have a parajumble question from IPMAT 2022. This is a four sentence question. However, let's keep in mind that parajumbles can also present five statements to you. Now, we have seen that five statement parajumbles sometimes are a little more time consuming than the four statement ones. It's not going to be true in all cases, but often it is true. So you might want to think about how much time you devote to each of these questions. As usual, I would advise you to pause the video at the right time and see if the way that you solve the question matches ours. Let's take a look at our first statement. We're going to be using the sort link sequence strategy. Now, the first statement says the popularity of these creations grew along with that of the tea ceremony in the 16th century. When we say these creations, we know that this is a follower. Let's take a look at the second one. However, savvy tourists find the best bargains for ceramics in Tokyo's kitchen town. Again, however, tells us that this is a contrasting point. So this will also have to be a follower. Now, statement three here says, Modern shops and touristy spots display thousands of them, both handcrafted and factory made. When it says thousands of them, what are we referring to? We are probably referring to ceramics. Now, if we read two and three together, do they present some sort of a contrast? Perhaps. Three says that modern shops in touristy spots display thousands of them. So we are suggesting that there are a lot of options. Now, two says, however, Savvy tourists, the smarter tourists, find the best bargains in one specific place. So we can see that two tells us a little more in contrast to three. So three and two could be our first mandatory pair. Now let's take a look at four. Japanese artisans have been making ceramics known as yakimono since prehistoric times. We can be fairly sure that this is a starter because we are introducing yakimono here. So this is my starter. Now, I also know that 3 and 2 are connected. So, what do I really do about 1? I might be able to say that, you know what, 1 talks about the 16th century. The fourth one also talks about prehistoric times. So, maybe there's a connection between 4 and 1. Let's take a look at our entire sequence one more time and then we will figure out the answer. What is the sequence that we have so far? We know that 4 is the starter and 3, 2 are linked. Now, we have to place one. We have already discussed that when it says the popularity of these creations, these creations probably refers to yakimono. When it says that the popularity grew in the 16th century, we are adding to the historical reference. So four and one can be logically connected. So now I have my answer. It must be four, one, three, two. Again, a very simple parajumble. And if you're able to forge these links quickly, then this is a no effort question. 